Hello, welcome to McPharmacy. How can I help you? How long will it take to fill this? I am in a hurry. Let me take a look at the prescription. Have you filled here before? Yes. I can't seem to find you in the computer system. This is ridiculous. I fill here all the time. When was the last time you got a prescription from McPharmacy? I never have. Then why did you say that you did? I fill for my daughter all the time. I should be under her name. I'm afraid I will have to register you separately. Is it done yet? The prescription is still in your hand. I really need this medication right now. Once you are registered your wait will be about 15 or 20 minutes. Oh my god. I want you to fill a prescription, not paint the Sistine Chapel. How long does it take to put some pills in a bottle? On average we fill one prescription every 45 seconds during the busiest 10 hours of the day. You need to wait while we help the 27 other people that were here before you. But this is an emergency. Move me to the front of the line. Now. <coughs> Clearly there are patients that were here before you that need their medication first. <coughs> I don't care. They should have thought about that before I got here. This prescription was written three weeks ago. If I don't get this right now, I will have to go to the emergency room, and it will be your fault. It is for a medication that will help your eyelashes grow longer and thicker. Eyelash-related emergencies were the third leading cause of all hospitalizations last year. If you were a real doctor, you would know this. Please do not piss in my face and tell me it is raining. I want to talk to your manager right now. It will take this medication several weeks to start working. Is that it on the shelf over there? Just hand it to me. A trained monkey could do this job better than you. One bottle costs $120. I have insurance. It is only $1. I only pay $1 for everything. I have very good insurance. May I have the card please, so I can bill your insurance? I don't have it with me. I need the information on the card, so I can bill your insurance. I come here all the time. You should know it by now. I need the name of the company, the name of the primary card holder, the BIN number, the PCN number, the ID number, the group number, the person code, and the suffix. Without this information I cannot bill your insurance. I can see it from here. Please hand me my bottle. Here is a dollar. I'm afraid I cannot bill your insurance without the card. Without insurance the cost is $120. You idiot. I am on Medicaid. You know I cannot afford that. Would you like me to call Medicaid for you to get the information that I need? No. I have the card with me. Then why did you tell me that you did not? Because I didn't want to walk all the way out to my car to get it. You mean the white Escalade parked in the handicapped parking spot? Yes, that is the one. I will be right back. I submitted the claim and they rejected it. They said that this drug is not covered. I have never had this problem before. Don't you know how to do your job? Are you stupid? I'm simply telling you what the insurance company told me. They always pay for everything. You did something wrong. Try it again. There is a chance that they will pay for it if you get a prior authorization. The doctor already authorized it. You have the prescription right there, moron. The insurance company wants to hear from your doctor to make sure that this prescription is medically necessary and that there isn't a more cost-effective alternative. Once that happens there is a chance that they will pay for it. Of course it is necessary. A doctor would not write a prescription if it were not necessary. Would you like me to contact your doctor to begin the prior authorization process? Will it take long? I only have five minutes. That is completely up to your doctor and the insurance company. It usually takes anywhere from one day to two weeks. Why will it take you two weeks to fill my prescription? Give me my bottle. It is mine. I have a prescription that says it belongs to me. Give it to me. I need it. Fine. I will pay for it. But, I thought that you said you could not afford it. I only have $100 bills. Do you have change for $100 bills? Yes. Before I ring you up, there is some information about this medication that you should know. First, do you have any questions about the medication for me? No, the doctor already told me everything. 
you should know that this medication may cause your eyes to turn brown. This change may be permanent. It also may cause itching and irritation. You may experience an ingrown eyelash that could scratch your cornea. You may also develop an eye infection which could lead to blindness. This medication may not start to work for months or years. Once you stop using it, your eyelashes will return to normal. You will need to continue to pay $120 every month for the rest of your life if you want to maintain your longer eyelashes. What did you say? My eyes might turn brown? Forget it. I do not want it. You should have told me this when I got here. Thanks for wasting my time. You are so rude. I am never coming back. I spent six years of my life studying to be a McPharmacist. Six years of my life I can never get back. 